So in this part, guys, we're going to be talking about an awesome company called Govi who do a lot of RGBIC uh, lighting that you would see in a lot of popular videos when it comes to people's YouTube setups, creative spaces, or even live stream setups. A lot of people use their products because they're high end, really high quality. And if you have any issues with their products, they have a great, 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 and I can't stress it enough, support team that will help you with the products that you have purchased. With that being said, uh, some of these products are on the high end as far as price goes. For example, these hexagon panels that you see behind me, they are in particular $200, but I want to stress, and I can't stress it enough, a lot of the products are under $100, and you can find some of their products even under $60. If you go to their website or go to Amazon or something like that, they always have some kind of uh, deal or sale going on, or they always have some kind of coupon code or something like that. So I just suggest definitely shopping around on different platforms and stuff for these Govi product. And if you're a content creator who tends to live stream on YouTube or Twitch, there's actually a program out there that I've covered in a previous video, which I will link in the description that actually allows the, the, the Govi lights to activate and change colors and stuff like that with the rgb when somebody follows you leaves a cheer or donation or anything like that even redeem channel points if you're on twitch and your lights actually in your room will react which is super super cool so again i can't stress it enough um, there will be some links to people who delve deeper into the customization of these lights uh, because this video will be super super long if i went to every single product of theirs that i have and how you could customize every single product that i have so again i can't sing their praises enough none of these products were sent out to me or wherever i've purchased all of them on my own i'm not sponsored by them or anything like that but there will be an affiliate link that uh helps me out a little bit to their product page to their website linked in the description so i just wanted to go ahead and clarify that with that being said though hopefully you guys have a squid day and enjoy the video <music> all right everybody so future squid here um this video ended up being about 35 minutes to 36 minutes long so i ended up breaking this down into three different parts so what you're about to see is previously recorded so anything that i reference in this video just know that there's other videos out there there will be a link in the description to those other videos and on top of that i will make sure to have a separate playlist that i will put in the card annotation up above on the right of your screen so you can watch those other videos now back to past squid now with these lights that i'm about to start talking about these lights are good I, there's no way i could fit into this video what these lights can do i am telling you right now um these lights that we're getting into is from a company called govi um i don't i have an affiliate link but i am not sponsored by them they did not send any of these lights out to me other than um two of them and they, those were for replacements because i had issues uh with two of the products or wherever but again they were sent out to me for free as far as those replacements goes but everything else i bought for my own money so these are the two lights that you see right here and over here um these lights are the uh govi glide lively lights now usually there's one that has a right angle um in a pack that you can get and i think they just released one that has like four right angles and like eight of these bars or something like that um i'll put the price of these uh govi lights uh on screen right now so you can see but i, I want to say these were between like 80 or 90 dollars or something like that you can usually find coupons especially like that if you use a, a couponing service like honey or something and um you check on amazon you know or you check their actually website or whatever you can usually find good deals and and getting some money off or whatever on these products now these products have a lot of customization within the app the gobi app itself um, not only from the default manufacturer like settings or whatever you can do from segmenting every single like different on the light bars or wherever or you can sit there and and have um the different actual factory setting presets or wherever in the app and then on top of that every single you know product of govies or wherever has a diy section where you can make your own or in that diy section you can actually download 
um, other people's DIY stuff that they have done themselves, you can download that and put it into your own uh, lighting source or whatever from Govi. So I really highly recommend the, these uh, these products from Govi. I know they can kind of get into the expensive territory with something like this, but if you're looking for the light bulb situation or you're looking for the LED strips and stuff like that, they have those products too. And they're obviously on the cheaper end as far as like uh, payment goes and everything, but the actual quality of it, you still get access, like I said, to their app, to their um, factory presets. And on top of that, the DIY section with the LED strips and those light bulbs. Um, so if you wanna get those first and then maybe move on to these kind of products from them as well, you can do that and they all fit in the govi app so you have a ton of customization options ton of color customization you got the segmented color customization the the numerous of factory uh presets and then on top of that the diy being able to download or make your own it's it's, it's crazy what govi can do for the for the price so you're definitely getting a, a very high quality product um, for the price of you know fairly being fairly cheap for something like this i decided to go with these instead of the right angle one just for my setup or whatever but if you looked at any youtube setup or anything like that you've probably seen these in people's live stream setups or the youtube setup or something like that or like a, um, a gaming setup or something like that video uh, i highly highly recommend these i can't sing their praises enough the best rgb company out there the products that i'm using are actually two because this is the product I had an issue with. I ended up getting this, um, and I think this is around, I want to say 60 bucks or something like that. Again, I'll put the price on screen. Um, I had ordered this off of Amazon, and I'm pretty sure somebody sent back uh, their pair, but didn't uh, desync it from their account. So the command module, I think, was sync still synced, or the lights were still synced to their account. So unfortunately, I wasn't able to sync it to my account. Um, but I was still able to use the little command control box that comes inside the light uh, or inside the kit. And um, I'm still able to use it on a static color, but I told Govi about it or wherever on Twitter. They told me to contact support. They sh and they shipped me out one in my next couple few days or wherever I had a new one arrive and it worked perfectly fine. And so I put all four of these on the back of uh, my monitor so my top monitor has two and then my main monitor has two as well and they're all static color and just how much color it throws on the wall and how bright they are it's perfect for you know covering that whole entire wall that's behind my monitors and stuff the adhesive mounts that come on the back or for the back of your monitors is great it, like it's super strong I haven't had them at an issue with them falling down or anything like that um and on top of that um it comes with like a little camera system that you can put over your monitor and um, whatever colors splash on your screen, the, you know, the light bars would do, um, you know, that color or whatever. And you can also uh, get some LED strips or whatever uh, from them that does pretty much the same thing. The I'm going to link in the description of the video um, to a person that actually goes highly in depth on this product just itself. And uh, you can see the kind of kind of options that you can get with just this kit alone or wherever. And honestly, just having one a kit of just one of these or wherever on the back of your monitor for what you look at and what you see or something like that. It should be just perfectly fine, especially if you're just using this for your TV space or like I said, you're not even doing content creation. Next up, we're going to talk about this that I've this is my first product that I got from Govi. And this is a, I know for a fact is one hundred and thirty dollars. Um, I had one wherever to where I think a faulty wire or something was wrong inside and they sent me a brand new one because the faulty wire would cause if I was using that light. Um, for any kind of RGB would cause it to flicker. And I have a, a viewer of mine that's susceptible to having uh, seizures because of like fast flickering lights. I showed him the video of it or wherever. And I was like, look, I'm just trying to, you know, figure out if I can just get a replacement um, for the actually LED strip or whatever. They asked for my order number. I showed them the evidence of it like flickering or whatever. And they were like, okay. And they sent me out a brand new one. No questions asked. 
didn't ask me to you know do shipping or anything didn't ask me to send that one back or whatever they have a slimmer one that's like around a hundred dollars or something like that 90 something dollars and it's just like a slimmer version of it this base is not too too big it doesn't take up too much room or whatever but if you're looking to you know maybe fit um it in a tight spot or something like that i would suggest going with the other floor lamp rather than this one but just keep that in mind the base is kind of kind of big obviously you can tell because it needs a fit in here there is a video where a guy goes in detail what you can do with it and everything i'll put that in the description as well because again the amount of customization that you can do with the govi light products they all need their pretty much dedicated own video and we're trying to do a routing uh lighting roundup so i want to be able to put it all in one video these hexagon panels the whole reason why i'm doing this video a subscriber of mine you know asks you know, about what were these hexagon panels now everything that i mentioned about these govi light panels or lights or whatever applies to all of them. the app as far as factory preset uh, lightings uh options and then on top of that you got the diy section like i said where you can make your own or have people down or download other people's stuff um these are the newest products from govi if i remember correctly um at the time of recording i think that this is the newest one they have they've had uh come out and these are 200 dollars. now these are a 10 piece set you can there's a connector in here add a set so if you get another set of these or whatever you can plug it plug it up to your previous one and that set will have a connector in there that you can probably hook up and more i'm not sure how many of these you can hook up together all in all but I'm hoping in the future that they sell maybe like a two pack or four pack or maybe a five pack of these as an add on rather than having uh, to buy a whole, you know, another starter kit 10 pack thing for $200. Um, that's what I'm hoping for. Um, but the customization is crazy as far as these options go. These are fairly newer. So as far as like the factory presets, um, there's not as much as the other lights because those lights have been around for longer So they're gonna when they get the firmware updates and stuff like that, they're gonna have more options uh, To have as far as a factory preset. So just keep that in mind if you do get these you're not gonna see a whole ton There's there's still a lot there, but it's not like a whole ton as versus when I got this one or whatever, the, the, the actual floor lamp, they already had a ton, a ton, like a scrolling and looking at the DIY and stuff because that, that had been out for a while. Now, the, the, the setup video is very easy. It comes with a QR code. You can scan it or whatever, and it allows you to set, it teaches you how to set up the panels and stuff like that. They stick securely to the wall. So make sure, that's my only thing about it, make sure you know exactly where you want these to go. The reason why I put these here is because the camera angle that I have, rather than having them higher up like a lot of people do, um, I just wanted to show these off on screen. And I was thinking about, you know, before I got this tapestry here, just having the whole wall filled with them or whatever. Um, just so if I turned the camera and go over here and had this wall behind me, you can see the the, the panels. The All the Govi lights that come like this, that's gonna stick to your wall, come with command strips. So if you're renting or something like that, you don't have to worry about damaging your wall and everything. And they're super secure. They're tough, even if you have to move it a little bit, you know, to um, maybe line it up a little bit more or wherever they they stick and when i say they stick they stick so it's hard to adjust so again if you're putting any of these on the wall make sure make sure make sure make sure you have it planned out the way you want it to be because it, once they're there it's kind of hard to remove them make sure you also follow that video that comes with these in detail make sure you this is something that you don't skip out on because some of the lighting options if you're not if you don't hook up the connectors right for each panel and you don't tell the the app or wherever exactly how you're hooking them up you can run into the issue of once you start using lighting options or wherever some of the lighting options don't work correctly uh, because it's saying that you know this connector is connected to this certain light panel or whatever so just make sure that you follow word for pretty much word for word uh, page for page or wherever on the video that comes with this that's that's the only thing um again I would suggest if you're getting hexagon panels, go with Govi. I know, again, these are $200. I understand that, but I can't stress this enough. When you go for cheaper lighting options, um, 
it's different from when you go with something like these LED strips or maybe even the light bars. When you start getting into something that's built like this, you start getting and with the cheaper ones that are like twenty dollars, fifty dollars, something like that. You can find them all over Amazon now. The problem with that is that these those light panels they start having that heat source problem. Like I was talking about putting the the flood lamp to the wall like directly touching the wall that's what you start getting you start getting this hot spot in the center or maybe on an edge or something of the hexagon and then you get like the faded color or whatever on the uh, other parts of the hexagon individually and it just doesn't look right even in person or on camera or wherever it just doesn't look right whether whereas this even if i wanted to just turn on the edge edges uh led lights for the hexagon panels instead of having the full color throughout you're still going to get that even distribution of lighting and you're not going to have to worry about having hot spots or anything like that through it now again these are a little bit more expensive but you still have the quality and if something is wrong with it again all you have to do is contact support tell them what's going on and they they help you even if they have to send you out a whole new product or something like that. I understand that it might be out of people's uh, people's budget. And hopefully in the future they come out with like, you know, own individual ways to, to get add ons or wherever. But even in my opinion, I still could justify doing that just because of the quality of them and everything. I probably would end up or am going to end up getting another pack or wherever, even if it's at that price point. I can see for a one time purchase, somebody just getting just one, one pack or wherever of these and calling it that's it. But if you don't want to get something like this or wherever and you're looking for a cheaper option, the Govi Glides, the options of the for the Govi Glides or wherever will work perfectly fine um you don't have to necessarily get the the hexagons or whatever these would these would suffice perfectly fine and um honestly you could just go with the led strips from them or the light bulbs to do the kind of idea like i said for the for the lamp and everything and i think you could still get the same kind of like use case out of those um out of those products as well so hopefully in the future i can have nothing but like a go v setup that would be really cool because again i just i really like their products and I, I, it's one of the rare companies out there for me at least that you know you get what you actually get what you pay for if not what you're getting is actually at a higher quality than what you pay for and then on top of that the really good customer service like i said responsive uh easy to work with and everything like that that's going to do it for the video. I'm going to have a full uh, YouTube studio slash office, you know, tour of what I use and products and stuff like that, because there's a lot of products outside of just the lighting that I have that I use um, on my day to day for live streaming, YouTube content and stuff like that, and just gaming in general. So if you're interested in something like that from me, then just hitting the subscribe button and turn on the notifications here on YouTube um, will let you know when that video goes live. If you do want to have a discussion about any of this stuff, Stuff, you can find my live stream uh, link in the description um, and you can go over there on Twitch and follow me and uh, turn on the notification so you know when I go live over there. If you do want to talk to me and see what I do personally or wherever or you know anything else outside of um, content creation or something like that you can follow me over on Twitter there will be a link in the description as well where I just you know tweet out random stuff about anime or just life stuff in general or when I actually go live on Twitch I tweet all that stuff out. With that being being said hopefully you guys continue to have a squid tastic day thank you guys for sticking with me through this long video i hope you guys appreciate it and uh, i'll catch you guys in the next one take care have a squid tastic day god bless you and yours deuces everybody